Legends tell of a king wielding terrible power. Before him, even the bravest hero would cower. Even death herself dared not mess with the king. Now undead and alone, he could no longer feel a thing. The king longed for the warmth of flame, the cold sting of pain or the love of a dame. He searched for eons but found nothing that could excite. Or so he thought. Then along came a certain night. Eternal reign is at an end, undying king, for I have come to end thy life. remains of it. <sighs> Pitiful mortal, standing amid a thousand dead. Do you not think I've heard those words again and again? <sighs> Can we skip the part where he swings thine sword with a misplaced righteous fury? I know not of what thou art speaking, King. Righteous fury? Of course! But misplaced? <sighs> it appears we cannot. I shall have thee eat thine words, for it shall be I, Reginald Normandy van Garfunkel, Fury of the Western Plains, chosen wielder of Havel's armor, who drags thine soul back to that golden... Another goal. Ha! I jest! Thy infernal hellfire means nothing to me. For I carry the ring of Lady Leonora, martyr of the fading deserts. And I was wielding the fabled bow of elven sight. My. my ever burning flames! The hottest in the Nine Realms. How, how did you- Ha! <laughs> hottest? I think that title goes to me, King. They should witness me without my armor. I, 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 I shall. After I strip that accursed armor from thy mangled corpse. Thinking about my chiseled body, King. How dost thou not recognize the famed sword of Daphior? 
the Master of Blades. It allows me to deflect every attack thou could possibly throw this, at me. This mortal. I have not felt pain since the fabled battle with the eight-armed Sky King of the Land Kingdom. I burned a thousand kingdoms to find a worthy opponent and he stands before me. So many dead lie in the wake of my quest. This blade has tasted the blood of countless beasts and legend, such as the giant two-headed snail and the four-headed dragon lord. What is this I feel? My undead heart, it beats. Strike me again, knight. Do it, harder. And now it too shall taste the all. What? 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 You're making it weird, King. Stop making it weird. I'm. I'm not making it weird. Just strike me down with all your might. Make me feel once more. It feels weird now. I. I didn't know this was like a, a thing for you. Not that I judge, of course. But. But. Perhaps I misunderstood. W were you not flirting with me the whole witness me without my armor thing? Oh god, no, King! How did you not notice? My wedding ring, given to me by the great Lich King of Morakdur. My husband. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Hey, listen, I'm gonna... Go... Wait! Uh, Knight! M maybe we can start again? Knight! Knight! Please, just one little battle. Your, your husband, he doesn't have to know. N Knight. Knight! Ah. The one that got away. That day an important lesson was learned by that ancient king. Even in the heat of the moment, check for a ring. The knight made the king feel that for which he so long sought. But a monster he may be, a homewrecker he was not. He tried his best to forget the knight that night, failing miserably until along came dawn's radiant light. The king had not felt that warmth for ten thousand years. Legends say that at that moment the king shed his first tears. Hear me, pitiful mortals. If my undead love life has entertained you in any way, consider checking out the Patreon of my creators, the Kitchen Knights. There you may see exclusive behind-the-scenes content, alternative timelines of this tragic tale, downloadable 3D models, concept art and narrated scene breakdowns by yours truly. Pledging your soul to our cause will directly contribute to the creation of our next film. And it might even grant us a sequel.